everybody, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first video with me, my name is Jason, and as you saw from the opening, I do unboxings. So in today's video, we are going to be doing my last box of this specific subscription. There wasn't really anything wrong with the subscription. I just found that it had kind of run its course for my own personal needs. So um, without any further ado, let's just get started. This is the Plant Club. Now, it comes in a fun little box like this. Okay, yeah, this is the, let's see when you open it. Now this um, subscription is I believe $24.95 a month and you're supposed to get a plant, a pot, um, some like decorative toppers for the pot and uh, soil. So um, I've gotten two other two other boxes from them. This is my third box and my last box. Um, I just found for me personally the plants weren't really all that different. So, but for this month when you open the box, this is what you get inside, which looks oops. I always do that now. <laughs> it's a cute little front to it. Okay, and inside this one, okay, so this month is gonna be a fern. So inside here, they tell you about the plant and they give you like care instructions. So let's see what our fern looks like. Um, okay, here is my tech kit. Normally, they put this tag kit in a little clear baggie. So this is different this month. They usually give you like a little wooden placard to stick in the pot so that you know what you're getting or what you have. Um, yeah, so like this, you just stick it in the soil and you write the name on it. They usually give you a pencil. Uh, this time we've got a little coaster. Um, what else do they give us in here? Uh, they give us the, the pencil to write on the little plaque. Plaque Club sticker. They always give you a magnet. Okay, and the magnet is always specific to the plant that's in the box. And then they always give you your little strawberry candy. All right, um, so we've got that. Let's stick that back in the little baggie so I don't lose them. We have our potting soil. Okay. I never end up using the entire potting soil, so you've always got some extra. Um, and then these are the decorative uh, rocks to put on top. And let's pull out the the pot comes wrapped in its own little box like this. I have enjoyed the pots that they've given us in the last two. They're really pretty. So again, there is nothing wrong. I haven't I haven't disliked this subscription. Um, I just kind of, I was hoping that the plants would be a little bit more varied and not look so similar. And I'm also running out of space in my apartment to put the, the plants. So let's see what pot they give us this time. And it's still wrapped. And it is ice cold. <laughs> So it's just kind of like this silver, this is nice too, silver pot. Okay, and it's got a little plastic, uh, you can't really, I don't know if you can tell from the video, but that hole is covered with a little plastic um, stopper. The bottom looks like that. It's a nice size pot. Seems to be one of the more wide pots that I've gotten, so but they're always in good shape, so that's good. 
And let's look at the, the plant always comes wrapped either like this or some t uh, one time it came in a green plastic sleeve. So let's pull this off and see what we have here. Okay, so this is our fern. Looks very healthy. Let's see, I'm gonna take some of the plastic off. Um, I have the first plant I got in my bathroom at the moment. We have like a, like a, um, a metal shelf over our commode. <laughs> and uh, we've got two plants on top of that. And then the last plant that I got is actually in my living room, just in front of the window. Um, this is a strange pot. This pot is like extra soft. I don't know why, but... but this is the plant. It seems to be fairly healthy plant. So that's good. And let's see here. Um, I kind of wish that the pot that they gave us would have resembled the picture they have on here. That would have been really fun to have like a boots pot. But um, I am going to try and pronounce the Latin for this plant. So they're calling the common name is the clubfoot fern. The Latin name, Terris Critica, is what I'm going to assume, is variegated. So that is the Latin name for it. And it says, uh, for this collection, we're bringing you Terris Critica Variegated, clubfoot, a fern with heavily forked tips, a spidery appearance, and narrow cream-colored strips down the center of green foliage. Native to parts of Europe, Asia, and Africa, this plant displays its vertical growing habits along steep slopes and rocky faces near warm, temperate forests and woodlands. It is even known to occasionally survive snowy winter months, which is good because, hello, we're in winter. Uh, whether standing alone or as a focal point or incorporated with other plants, this unique species of fern is sure to draw the eye with its range of green tones and forked sets of leaves with distinctly serrated edges. We're sure it will be a great addition to your growing collection, the Plant Club. Okay. Well, we all know by now that I'm not going to be the one that's going <laughs> to be caring for this plant. It's going to be my husband, so... Um, that will do it for this video. So again, I will put the information for this subscription below. I ended up getting it through CrateJoy, um, which is, I, I love CrateJoy. It's so easy to subscribe, so easy to cancel if you need to. Um, but uh, that's where I found the, the plant club. So I will put all the information below and that will do it for my last box of the plant club. Um, who knows, maybe down the line I may decide to do it again. We'll see. Anyway, it's a good subscription. It just, like I said, ran its course for my own personal needs at the moment. So thank you for watching. Um, I hope everybody is having a safe holiday so far. Um, we're getting really close to Christmas, New Year's. So um, everybody, I hope you're staying healthy and happy, and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.